So I made now my 40 chains, okay? Here the joining yarn, where I joined my yarn, I gonna, I thread my yarn and go into the head with my uh, yarn, okay? Just pull and hide the rest of the yarn into the head. So go into the spaces. So, and the rest you can cut, okay? And now we're gonna make slip stitches, okay? From the second chain from the hook, we're gonna make slip stitch. In each chain, we're gonna make slip stitch. Like this, okay, until end of the row here, until end of the, or beginning of the chain here, and then I see you again. Now I finished my first hair strand, okay, and then I go uh, after the last uh, stitch here, I go into the next uh, front loop, pull the yarn, and then I'm going to make again 40 chains. Okay, so you're going to make in all front loops around the head in each loop one hair strand. So you're going to crochet, you're going to make 40 chains and then uh, go back with slip stitches, okay, and then make your hair strands like this in each loop one hair strand around the head, okay, and I see you again. So I finished my hair strands so and now we continue with the tail part for that I'm using a different pink color uh, than the hair all right and here we're gonna make 15 chains. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. And now from the second chain from the hook, you're gonna make one slip stitch. And then in the next one single crochet, one more time a single crochet, and then two half double crochet. Then we're gonna make one double crochet, one more, so two double crochet we have now, and then we're gonna make one triple crochet. And we're gonna repeat now this side to the other side, okay. We're gonna make now 
again two double crochet in each chain one and then two half double crochet uh yes two half double crochet in each chain one and then one single crochet and one slip stitch and we're gonna turn to the opposite side okay and make same way the tail to the other side so I finished the first one of the tail and now here I'm going to make again 15 chains Fourteen, fifteen, okay, and to make same way here the tail, same way like the first one. So I finished <coughs> the tail now and left a long uh, tail from my yarn and just go through the uh, stitches here, okay come to the middle here and then you're gonna sew it here on the tail okay and I see you again also hide this yarn through the stitches so the tail is also attached now and now to the belly here okay this one this part here you're gonna uh, make 36 chains okay 36 chains and then we're gonna make uh, from the second chain from the hook to the second chain from the hook we make slip stitch one two and so three slip stitch and then three single crochet one two three then we're gonna make four half double crochet one two three Four, and then five double crochet one two three four five now we're gonna make five triple crochet one the second So like that and now you're gonna make until end five double crochet four half double crochet three single crochet and three slip stitch like this one here like the beginning here so I finished it okay and we're gonna sew it to the body Like that. 
Okay. Maybe you have to pull a little bit, but you should sew it like this. Okay. So I finished the bell here, the belly here, okay, and uh, glue um, crystal stone here. Now for the seashell top, we're gonna make two uh, small applique, seashell applique, okay. For that, I already made one. I'm using this color. So, and now we make the second one. We need two. For that, we're gonna make magic ring. And then five single crochet into the magic ring. Two, three, four, and five. Pull your yarn, close your circle and close your circle with a slip stitch. Okay, and now you chain one and in the same stitch you're gonna make one half double crochet in the same stitch and then one slip stitch in the next and one more half double crochet in the next half double crochet and then slip stitch in the next stitch slip stitch and then you're gonna make two chains and in the same stitch you're gonna make one double crochet same stitch one double crochet in the next stitch we're gonna make three triple crochet triple stitch so. Sorry, we make three triple crochet. It's the one in the same stitch, okay? So and then in the next stitch we're gonna make one double crochet and chain two and go into the same stitch with a step, slip stitch okay and then into the next stitch you're gonna make one slip stitch and finish off then cut your yarn And hide the rest of the yarn through the stitches on the back side. So I finished now both seashell appliques. Okay, and now I thread my yarn. I just go, uh, just take the back side, okay, and go through the stitches with your yarn. Go through here. And then the second, through the second, and take the middle of your top, okay, so like that, and then we just here make a note on the back side.
and cut your yarn. You can make here also a little bow if you want. So also the top is finished. Okay. Now we're gonna make the arms and then the face. So now we're gonna make the arms. I already made the uh, one of the arms, okay, and attached it also uh, already to the body. Now we're gonna make the other one with you. So for that we're gonna we're gonna take also body color. Yes, the beige one, and make one uh, magic ring. And into the magic ring we're gonna make six single crochet. One, two. Three, four, five, six. Pull your yarn and close your circle. And in the second row now, we're gonna uh, increase the first stitch. We're gonna make two stitches in the first single crochet and two single crochet in the second, in the next. Okay. And then, oops. And then we're gonna make four single crochet. One, two, three, and four. Now we have eight stitches and we're gonna make two more rows with eight stitches. So at the fifth row now, we're gonna increase three times. So we're gonna make two stitches in the first, two single crochet in the first, Sorry, I repeat again now. Two stitches, two single crochet in the first, in the second also two single crochet, and in the first also two single crochet. So we, we made three increases and then five single crochet. In each stitch one single crochet. And now we have 11 stitches around the row, okay? And the next row, the sixth row, sixth row, uh, the next row, we're gonna make one row with 11 stitches. We're gonna continue now at the next row. At first, we're gonna make one single crochet and then two decreases. So we're gonna decrease two stitches together this is the first and then again two stitches together and the second. So we made two decreases and then three single crochet. One, two, three and we're gonna decrease again two stitches together. And into the last stitch we're gonna make one single crochet. Now we have uh, eight stitches left here around the row, okay? And this yarn you can put into into the head uh, into the hand part here, yes. Or you can cut however you want. So. And now we have here eight stitches, okay? Now we're gonna make here 18 rows with each row uh, eight stitches. So I finished all the, the second arm and attached it already to the body, okay, like this. Now I'm gonna make the face here, okay? I have two beads. And I thread my yarn, a thin yarn, okay, just go in any, any, any space here in and look to your toys here, yeah, I think one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, between eight and nine rows, one, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine. I think here, I think two, one, one up here between eight and nine row. And be good. So you leave one, two, three, three spaces. like that here and go to row up make the eyebrow just skip one one space and go into the other space and also here Skip one and then if you want you can make also the eyelashes here okay here this part And same way on the other side of the eye. I like that. Okay? Same way this side. So I finished also the nose and lips. I embroidered it to the face and made some makeup. But I think here I put a little bit uh, too much makeup here. And my second mermaid is finished. This was Ariel. Okay. And this is my second mermaid. And I hope, oops, the top. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. And see you in my next video as soon as possible. And thank you for watching. See you soon. Bye-bye.